Welcome! In this video I'm going to be taking a look at adding a silent audio track to a video file using FFmpeg. So I'll put a link in the description to the commands I'm using in this video, and I'll also have a link to my FFmpeg notes where you can find installation information for FFmpeg, and a link to my FFmpeg playlist. So I have this video on my desktop called Video Without Audio. I'll open that up, and I'll play it here, and you see there's no audio track on here. You don't have a volume slider. So the reason you might want to add audio to a video like this is that you want to upload it to some site that requires audio. So I'll close this, I'll go into my terminal here, I'll go to my desktop, I'll do CD desktop, and then I can type ffprobe, and then the name of my file, I'll hit enter, and we can see this has a video track here, it's an H.264 video track, it's a 1920 by 1080. Okay, so I'll clear my screen here. So to add a silent audio track, we'll type ffmpeg space dash i space, and then the name of the file, and then space dash f space lavfi space dash i, space a null src. So this is audio null source. Then I'll type space dash v codec space copy. So this will copy the video from the original file to the destination file without modifying it. Then space a codec space aac then space and then dash shortest. So what this will do is it will make the destination file the size of the smallest input file. So the video with audio is about 30 seconds and the silence, it goes on forever. So what this will do is it will make the destination file as long as the video file. If you didn't use this, it would make it go on forever. Then I'll type space, and then I'll type video underscore with underscore silence dot mp4 as my destination file. I'll hit enter, and this executed immediately. This is because it's mostly copying things over and it's super easy for it to encode that audio track. I'll clear my screen here. If I type FF probe now on video with silence, you'll see we have this audio track here. So if I open that up, you see there's an audio track. So this was the basic functionality of doing this. Video file didn't have an audio track already. I'll do a future video on taking an audio track out. You can replace audio tracks and things like that, but that gets a little more complicated. I wanna keep it simple with this video. If you have any questions about this, please leave it in the comments. If you like this video, please click like, if you haven't subscribed to my channel, I'd appreciate it if you could do that. And thanks for watching. Until next time, goodbye.